Hello everyone, welcome to another edition of Rod's Random Reviews, and today I'm going to talk about one of my favorite subjects, and it's a John Grisham book. This one is about Suli. Just finished the book a couple of days ago and thought I would do a real quick review of the book. Um, it's okay, there won't be any spoiler alerts. I'm not going to tell you you know, what happens in the book other than give you some general guidelines. Uh, first of all, you should know that uh, I'm a huge John Grisham fan. I have all of his first editions. Let me see if I can find them here for you. But anyway, um, I started out reading, like many of you did, The Firm, and uh, which is actually his second book, as you see there. I read The Firm in one night. I paid probably 26 bucks for it back when you paid full price. Then uh, immediately went to the bookstore the next day. This was before Amazon.com and all that. I think I went to Barnes & Noble or somewhere. And they found me a first edition, Time to Kill, and I ordered it. Took it the old-fashioned way, about a week to come in. And then I read A Time to Kill. I decided to pace myself. I said, I'm going to read one-third the first night, one-third the second night, and one-third the third night to try to stretch out my money's worth. So I did that. And then, of course, you see all the other ones, some of which have been made into movies. And, of course, uh, Theodore Boone, don't forget the kid lawyer. He is awesome as well. You're going to love any of these John Grisham books. So, being a sports guy, uh, especially liked it, being a basketball guy. So, here's, here's John in his uh, high school days, I guess it was. And uh, he and I are about the same age. It looks a lot like my uniform when I played high school basketball. He wanted to be a college basketball player, as did I. And I actually went to the University of Alabama in Huntsville to do just that play basketball, and long story, but I wound up playing soccer instead. So, a little bit about this book. Suli is a South Sudan basketball player who makes their national team, barely. I guess that's not necessarily a um, spoiler alert. Um, and he is really rough around the edges. But what he does have is a lot of athletic ability. So the coaches see that and they realize that he is a, a potential project. A lot like our UAH players uh, that come to UAH. They are, uh, there's a lot of potential. Division I schools, you know, may have overlooked them and that sort of thing. But just real quick, uh, you can tell that uh, John Grisham is influenced by Pete Maravich, uh, who knows, maybe even Steve Nash a little later on, and Josh Majette these days, uh, who played for, uh, Josh played for the Atlanta Hawks and Orlando Magic. But these three individuals are basically magicians with a basketball, with behind-the-back passes and deep threes and that sort of thing. So, um so John was definitely influenced by them. So I don't think you're going to see that many behind-the-back passes, John, in the NCAA tournament. Uh, but you will see deep threes and that sort of thing, like uh, uh, Josh Majette, Steve, Steve Nash, and, and, of course, Pete Maravich would shoot from anywhere. But anyway, uh, a lot of life lessons in there about working hard, um, you know, whether it be in the basketball gym or um, – elsewhere. Uh, a lot of uh, modern day um, issues John covers um, with, uh, so if you've been watching the news the last year or two, you know what I'm talking about. So, um, so a lot of uh, interesting things going on in this book. I'm not going to tell you about the ending, uh, but you know, all of John Grisham's books are very, very uh, captivating. They are very uh, much a page turner, and uh, you can't help but become a Suli fan. And um, so I'm gonna leave it at that. I may do a more detailed review 
when I get back home, I'm actually on travel right now, and I just wanted to pop something out there to let you know. I highly recommend Suli. If you are a basketball fan, if you are a NCAA basketball fan, NBA fan, you're going to see a lot of uh, inside scoop on what goes on. Uh, and I think a lot of it is pretty close to real, except those behind-the-back passes, John, in the NCAA tournament. All right, thanks for watching. Um, I hope to have more book reviews and movie reviews going forward uh, with Rod's Random Reviews. So subscribe and like, and there's no tellings what I might review next. Thanks, everyone.